All right, Caleb, what game are we playing today? Can't Stop. Ooh, Can't Stop. Do you like Can't Stop? Yes. Can you ever really stop? Uh, yeah. Do you? Uh, sometimes. <laughs> well, what's Can't Stop all about? It's about pushing your luck to get to the e to get to the top of the board. Ooh, let me see the board. You like push your luck games, huh? Yeah, it's like a stop sign. It is. Oh, sweet! And you That's got traffic. That's why it says stop in it. <laughs> nice. And you got traffic cones. Sweet. Well, what do you do? How do you play? Well, first you roll the dice. Okay. And what do you do after you roll those dice? And then you pair them up however you'd like. So I could do a five, a four, or I could do a three or a six. Okay, so you pair them up and then what? Then you place the runners on whatever you want to do. So I'll do it on three and six. And you put them at the start? Yes. So those are how many steps it takes to get to the other end of the board. Yeah. Okay. So when you roll one, you move it up. All right. Let's see. So is that it? Can you stop? Yeah. But, but are I you going to? Because I still have one more runner. Yeah. Place. Three runners. Yeah. Okay. So you just roll again. And what'd you get? I didn't get one of the plates, so I have to choose a new one. I could choose an eight. Oh, I did get a six actually. Okay. So I don't have to place the 8 anymore. Why? What can you do? I can just move that up and then well again. So as long as you can move one, you don't have to place your last runner, huh? Yeah. Sweet. Then you roll again. And you got? A 6. Wow. You're just going to keep going. So, so I just do that. I don't think you're going to stop. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Sometimes that's the way that they are. And then I got a 3. I'm going to do a three instead of a six. Man, all right. Well, you're doing good. Hey, you finally have to place something. Five. Okay, so you place that on a five. Now what's going to happen? Now, if I don't get any of those numbers, then I bust and all of them go away. Oh, okay. So you're going to take your chance? Yep. And what'd you get? Did you get a three, a five, or a six? Got a five and, and a six. A six. Nice. I think six is just like to be rolled. Yeah. <laughs> so far, I've rolled four of them. Okay, I got another six. And you're gonna go again? <laughs> yep. Well, why don't you show me if you stop? Well. Show me as if I you were to stop. I just busted. Oh, okay. So what happens if you busted? All of them go off. You lose all your progress. But, okay. What happens if you didn't bust? Okay. So if I so didn't bust. So if you had bust, decided to stop. Then I would have taken three of my pieces and then switched the place and put checkpoints down. Okay. So those are like checkpoints. So next yeah. time So if I so so they win and they got like do 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 and that. Okay, so somebody else is out there, let's say. Yeah. So and then I go. And I got a six. Okay, so where do you put the runner? Right in front of the checkpoint. Ah, nice. And I have to put a four down because it's my first turn and I can put two down. And then you were able to pair up two, so you have to do those. Yeah. Okay, sweet. And then so now let's say you go along, you got another six. I got another okay. six, so I just keep on going. Okay, so now let me ask you some questions. Okay. You're going to tell me that you got a four and you're going to move your four, huh? Uh, I got a three. You got a six, too. Oh, well. Okay, mm -hmm. all right. Let's see. So you can move your six. So now, if you bust, what happens? Do you lose all your? I don't lose my checkpoints. Okay, so if you busted, only what would you do? Only lose the runners. So those runners come off, but your yellow stays there. Yes. But if you decide to stop, then, then what do you do? You move them up to there. Okay. And then, how do you know who wins? When someone gets three on this. So if you get three across to the other end, that's great. Well, so if you completed the number six column yes. and somebody else rolled sixes. Then they can't place it there. Right. So anybody in the six column disappears, right? Yeah. All right. So, so I just got a seven. So I'm just going to keep on rolling. 
I'm still pushing my luck. I got a seven and another seven. So I stack them on top. Yeah, that's pretty cool how they stack on top. Yep. And then I just got another six. So I move that up. And okay. then I'm going to stop. So I do this and pretend he had one right here. Okay, if he had one in the sixth column when you then get to the he end. would be removed from that column. And for sixes good. can never count again. Yes. Woo! So as you go further in the game, a lot of those numbers are going to be out. Yeah. So your chances are even going to go further Damn. down. So how many people can play Can't Stop? Four people because there's four colors. Ooh, and I like those colors. And I always pick yellow because yellow is my favorite color. Ah, you like to play with yellow. Well, what would you rate Can't Stop? I would rate it a 4.5. Awesome, because you like to play it over and over. Yeah. And who and usually I wins if you and I are playing... Me. And if me and Jaden are playing, I usually lose. But you love to press your leg, don't you? Yeah. And Jaden lives on a rule that says, I will always push my luck until I bust. <laughs> or until I get to the top of the cop-up. Wow, that's dangerous. Yeah, I but know, he and he always wins. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> so now I'm going to try doing that. <laughs> All right, thanks, Caleb. Okay.